Hi guys, what's up and welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I have a winter haul for you and I'm so excited because all the sweaters I got are so cute and they're honestly just like perfect for the winter season. I am in Hawaii right now, so it's kind of hot wearing all these winter items, but I'm still super, super excited to share because I know you guys live in colder seasons, so this is something that might be beneficial for you. So anyway, without further ado, if you guys wanna know what I have in this haul, just going to keep watching. As always, if you guys are not part of the Ignals Angels, please go ahead and click subscribe down below and let's go and get started. Let's start off with what I'm wearing because this is probably my favorite like little chevron sweater. It's very preppy and I love the matcha green color and it's just so cozy even right now because it's been like really really chilly the last couple of days and I've been able to wear this and I'm really really enjoying it. It is super cute, super cozy, super nice and it's not one of those like sweaters that are super super itchy which I love because I hate an itchy sweater like I cannot stand itchy sweaters. So yeah, this is really nice and I cannot recommend it enough. Also, I will go ahead and apologize in advance if the lighting kind of goes in and out. Um, it's like sunny outside right now, but then maybe in like five minutes it'll be cloudy again. So I'm so sorry about that. But moving on to the next item, this is probably one of my favorite pickups from this haul. I got this little like crop cardigan slash shawl, or I think it's called a bolero, but I love, love, love these because I'm someone who like gets cold pretty fast and I need like a light cardigan to kind of just like throw on whenever I feel a slight coldness in my body. So these are perfect. I honestly have so many of these. I have it in like a knit material and then I also have it like in the silky material and they're honestly perfect. They match really well with any workout tops that you throw on, specifically like sports bras or if you're wearing like a an overall or like a jumpsuit workout piece they are literally like a match made in heaven because you can just easily throw them on it honestly just covers your hands as well as your shoulders like your upper back and you are good to go and i feel like they are really really nice to have in anyone's closet they match with so many things and i cannot recommend this enough moving on to the next sweater i picked up this really really soft brown knitted sweater and i feel like this is almost like a men's size sweater but i think i picked this up at from the women's section but this is what it looks like it's super plain super brown but i just love the very simple design on it and when i tell you that this is super 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 soft i wish you can reach through your camera not camera your screen and just feel the softness of the sweater because it is just so freaking soft you guys and i think this is one of those sweaters that are kind of like a little bit heavy on your body but like not too heavy to the point where it's kind of like dragging you down because this one is definitely like thicker material than my little green sweater right here but i honestly love it and this is again something that you can mix and match with a lot of different outfits due to the color of the sweater it's just like this dark mocha brown and i honestly love it so 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 much and you guys need to pick this up like you have to pick this up up next i have this little light beige sweater and i feel like this reminds me of the aritzia sunday best crew neck that emma chamberlain partnered up with aritzia this is what it looks like like if you guys shop at aritzia tell me this does not look like the aritzia sunday best crew neck sweater it is so freaking soft you guys and i kid you not i almost bought the one from aritzia but it's just it's a little too expensive for me especially because like i don't wear winter items all throughout the year so i feel like it just wasn't worth the money for me but don't get me wrong i love aritzia okay like i give them my money all the time but there are some pieces that i just can't you know justify just because like i'm probably only gonna wear them three months out of the year but this is what it looks like it is a beige sweater you have that little Little knotted knitted look on the arms as well as the front and it is a mock neck so it's not super low here it's a little bit up here but it's not a turtleneck and this is what it looks like I could have gone a size large honestly I got some a size medium and I feel like the size large would have been perfect for me because I love a baggy crew neck or like a sweater and this one fits really nicely but I wish that I got a size large moving on I picked up this white speckled little sweater right here this 
this is something that I can honestly wear right now because it is really not really thin but it's thin enough to the point where I can wear it as a cover-up during the nighttime when it's like a little chilly and it has like that boyfriend fit to it and it's also a very relaxed fit like it's not super structured it's something that you can just easily throw on moving on to the next item I picked up this little v-neck um, sweatshirt or knitted sweater and I feel like everyone has this already but I don't have it in this little beige color and I like that this one is extra oversized fit like I said I'm a hoe for anything oversized so I had to get this one and I like that this one has a little cut like a little v-cut so I can wear my necklaces I think if there's anything that I wear the most it is probably necklaces and my rings and a couple of you know bracelets that fit me but I love that I can show off my layered necklaces but this is just what it looks like it's super super basic honestly but it's something that you can get a lot of wear off just because of how simple and versatile this sweater is moving on to the next sweater I picked up this really cute teddy and honestly I would give this like a 5 out of 10 online it looked really really nice but this one kind of feels a little you know a little too cheap in my opinion don't get me wrong I've gotten so many sweaters from them that are literally great quality and would probably cost like maybe a hundred dollars from somewhere else but this one just did not make the cut however I do like the style and the colorway and it is this like brown and white teddy jacket and it is a mock neck and it also has really cute pockets but the inside is just like this very cheap polyester feeling to it and I just was not vibing with it that much but nonetheless this is still something that I would wear maybe in the morning when I go on my morning walks um, and call it a day but the next items are bottoms let's start off with my favorite skirt right now I picked up this black little skirt right here because I have been meaning to wear skirts with my knee-high boots lately or like some tights on them so I got this black one and you guys this one fits so freaking nice I know Princess Polly has something very similar to this if not maybe even the same I wouldn't know I don't have the Princess Polly skirt but I mean the quality of this is so freaking good you guys and it fits so snug if you guys were wondering I got this in a size extra small and my waistline is 25 and I'm 5'2 and it is the perfect length and you know just tightness around my waist so it is this black one I feel like you can honestly dress this up or down whichever way you want it is a very versatile um, skirt and I love that it also has a little lining on the inside so you're not showing your coochie off for the world to see in contrast to what I just showed you guys I wish this one fit a lot better on me but it didn't but it is this khaki little skirt I went to Brandy the other day saw a skirt exactly like this but maybe like a little lighter like a lighter khaki um, I did not get it because that one did not fit, but this one also didn't fit, unfortunately. I feel like the waist needed to be a little smaller and the length needed to be a little shorter. I'm not saying that I want my coochie out for the world to see, but it just needed to be a little shorter to make it look good. There's that perfect mini skirt that I'm looking for and it just did not deliver with the skirt. So this is what it looks like. I will probably be donating this to Goodwill. Um, just because I know someone out there might like it moving on to some accessories. These are super super random I put these order in right before my snow trip, but it didn't arrive So I now have these for my next snow trip But the first one I got is this white little snow bunny um, Earmuffs and I wish these came before my snow trip like Look at her when I went on my snow trip there was a blizzard there was a blizzard and we couldn't really like snowboard i also had food poisoning in that trip but you know i still got the content done and this would have been so cute in the snow guys and it's just so fluffy and soft and i'm just gonna have to like go on another snow trip this year maybe or just like save it for next year um speaking of like warmers i have this white one and it is so cute you guys i love the ugg minis and i also have the ugg taz like the platform slipper ones and you can just wear these on your ankles and out and about it is so freaking cute and they actually warm you up and i highly 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 recommend it and i feel like they're like sold out everywhere right now and if they're not sold out, they're like super expensive. They're such on high demand right now. But I got it and it was so affordable and 
it's literally the same thing from Amazon. I guarantee you it's the same thing from Amazon, but a fraction of the price. Up next, I have very random beauty accessories. The first one I have is this little, like, what do you call this? Like where you put your nails to kind of like soak off the gel nail polish and i've been needing this because i told myself that this year i am going to try my best and do my own nails so like now that i have this i can just easily like soak off my nails do my gel nail polish and i'm good to go but basically you just open this and you can put hot water in here put this on top lock it you know so it's not gonna go anywhere and then pour acetone right here and then soak off your nails i'm so sorry for the light change i honestly can't control it since i'm using natural lighting but the next item i have is actually a little duo and this is a makeup mixer and it's in the shape of a heart and you basically just like hold it like this you can put your foundation and then get mixing speaking of mixing i got this little like tool that you can use to mix your foundation and i think this item is like trending on tiktok right now because i've seen so many girls like try to apply their foundation i don't know if it's sideways or going this way i don't know i'm gonna have to like look at that tiktok but i've been meaning to try it because you don't need a lot of foundation at all to use this so i'm really really interested because i feel like sometimes i'd be putting a lot of foundation on for like what reason i don't know that concludes my haul i hope you guys enjoyed it i know this was a very short one but i will link everything down below definitely check out the description box because all of the product links will be down there all you have to do is click it and yeah anyway thank you guys so much for watching and i love you guys so 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 much and i'll see you guys next time bye